Hello, hello, hello. Welcome again. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, this is another instructional video on Scratch on uh, another STEM topic, which I love. All right, so for this particular video, what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to make things chase your sprite. So in a previous video, I showed you how to make your up, down, left, and, and right arrows um, control your sprite. So your sprite can move up, down, left, right, and so forth. But that's, that's all fun and games and everything, but let's add some complexity to our project, all right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create something that chases my sprite. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, choose a sprite from my library. And the sprite that I'm going to choose is going to be a bat, OK? So I'm going to double click on this bat here. And it's going to um, be inserted into my program, OK? Now, obviously, I'm going to move my sprite over here, my bat sprite over here. And what I'm going to do is the first five blocks that uh, we should have in any one of our sprites is obviously when the green flag is checked. Then I wanted to go to its starting point. Notice my X and Y coordinates are where my bat sprite is right now. So I'm going to drag this over. Um, one of the things that I'm going to do with this particular sprite is I'm going to actually going to set its rotation to left and right. If I don't do that, then it will actually rotate sort of like a clock will. Um, but this way, it will just turn left and right as it's chasing my sprite around the screen. So then those other um, options that I'm going to do is I'm going to set its costume. Um, actually, I'll, no wonder things look strange. I'm going to throw on tab. So I'm going to switch its costume. And then I'm going to uh, show because I want it to be at the beginning. And then I'm going to set its size. And uh, what I want is I want this particular sprite to be about half of its size. Um, I might shrink it a little bit more just depending on how large it is. All right. So now. All right, so yeah, that, that's that's a good size, okay? So now to get this bat to chase my sprite, what I have to do is I have to uh, put a forever loop in, and then I have to um, tell the bat to always point towards my sprite and then move, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on my motion tab here, and then point towards, and I want to click on a drop down arrow. So I want it to point towards sprite number one. And then I want it to move a certain amount of steps. Now, the, the more steps, the faster your sprite. And one of the things that you don't, I mean, it, it all depends on your game, but the faster, um, the more steps, the faster your sprite. So I want this particular sprite to go just a tad bit slower than my cat sprite, OK? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, say, move three, uh, actually two steps, OK? So now when I click on the green flag, my sprite, the bat, will always be chasing my cat. And my cat will always be slightly faster than the bat. Okay? So that is an instructional video on how to get things to chase your sprite.